Hello, happy Tuesday. I had to think about that for a second. <laughs> I hope everyone's doing well. Welcome to bar outside today. It is a perfect day. It's been a perfect day. Um, let's continue that great energy with bar today. Um, I have some music playing. Let me know at any time if it's too loud and I can turn it down for us so you can hear me. The music is nice, but I think it's more important to hear me. I'm going to pause it for a moment. So today's class, we are going to slow things down. We are going to take our reps and maybe increase them, um, increase our sets. So we're going to go a little slower. We're going to go reps a little higher, sets a little higher. And so we really get into those muscles and challenge them. Um, you may be sore tomorrow. Even if you've taken bar every with me every week, you might be a little bit more sore tomorrow and that's okay. So for class today, I'm using my bender ball. You don't need a ball. It's, you know, and if you have something at home, it could be um, a bouncy ball, one of your kids outside play balls, a soccer ball, anything. It's just something to add a little bit of challenge to your workout. I'm also going to be using weights. I have my hand weights nearby and I also have a heavier weight for when I do my deadlifts um, or like an overhead press. But again, you don't need it. You could even fill up one of these. This is about two pounds when you fill it all the way up. That's enough weight. That's fine. So our focus is going to be, um, again, higher reps, higher sets, and lower, slower. And in between, we're gonna be doing some push-ups, chest push-ups and tricep push-ups in between each sequence of exercises. Sounds like fun, doesn't it? If you're new to bar, do what feels good, listen to your body, modify when you need to, um, and I'll always show modifications and have fun. Make sure you have proper footwear, so sneakers or barefoot's great, um, or a bar sock, Pilates sock, and uh, I have my mat and my surface, my stable surface. So when we go to the bar, I will use my chair, but you could use a countertop, a couch, whatever feels good for you, and stay hydrated. All right, I'm gonna turn the music on and we're gonna get warming up. So I'm gonna keep my hand weights nearby, but I'm not gonna use them initially for the warm up. And again, if you can't hear the music and you want me to turn it up, let me know. I could do that too. All right. So I have my space around me. I'm going to move this over. Make sure you can see me. I'll move back just a little bit. All right. Let's start. Let's start with our feet parallel, just under our hips, or maybe just a smidge outside. I want you to give me four big inhales. Get some oxygen into your lungs for a workout. Squat on four. Give me another one. Three. Two more. One more. Awesome job. All right, slowly. Let's take a two by two squat back and up. Squat back and up. Think about your form right now while we're going nice and slow. Shoulders back, chest up, abs braced, butt goes back, knee over toes. Nice job. Give me eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Give me one more. And I want you to give me a triple pulse down. Three, two, one, come up. Let's keep going. Three, two, one, come up. Three, two, one, come up. Three, two, one. So you're pushing up, push up, two, three, and down, two, three, up. Keep it up. Awesome. Three, two, one. Give me three more. How are you feeling? Your legs starting to warm up? How about one more? Three, two, one. Now take it down, hold it down. Half up for eight, eight, seven, six. Five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Can you inhale up? Nice. Now I want you to come down a little wider to a wider squat position. Again, slowing it down initially, warming up and loosening those muscles and ligaments before we get the work started. Let's go two by two. Down two, 
and up to. So again, it's the same idea of a squat. You just trail over your toes, but my legs are wider. So I'm targeting inside my legs a little more than a standard squat. Keep going. Give me 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more. Now what I want us to do is a triple pulse and then raise it up. Three, two, one, just the right side. Three, two, one, bring it up. Three, two, one, bring it up. Three, two, one, eight more. Come on, eight. And up, seven. Five. How's that feeling? <laughs> Four. Three. Now it doesn't matter how high up your leg goes. You can go much lower, that's fine. One more. Other side, let's go for 12. Left side, triple pulse. Three, two, one, up. Three, two, one, up. Three, two, one, Three, two, one, come on. Squeeze, lengthen, and strengthen. Three, two, one. What number are we at? Oh dear, give me four more, four. Give me two. Give me one more, nicely done. Three, two, one. Awesome job. Inhale up. I believe uh, quads are warmed up as are our glutes. So let's take that right leg back. Warm up in the lunge position. So take it back and I just want you to take it down and up two by two for 10, nine. Now at any time, if lunges kind of challenge your balance, go to your stabilizer, put your hand on it and that will help you Get the best range of motion. Give me four, three, two, one. Nicely done, come on down. Nose over toes. I want you to draw your knee up and out. Up and out, I'm gonna go side on. Again, come low and use your stabilizer if you need to. And up for eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one. I want you to come down, get a little lower, please. And I want you to pick up that pace. Two sets of eight, pick it up, let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, another set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Everything we do right, we gotta do left. So I'm gonna take my opposite leg forward. And we're just gonna take those single set squats. Oh, my other leg, ready? Let's go. Two by two, eight, seven, six, five, four. Chest is up, shoulders back, abs are braced, knee trails over the toe. Three, two, one, awesome job. Again, I'm gonna go side on so you can see me. Bring it down, testing your balance. So this is working your core, your legs, everything. I want you to take it in and out for eight. You can even tap down if you need to. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, whoop, one more, one more. One, awesome job. Get down a little lower. Two sets of eight, pick it up. Almost done with our warm up. Five, four, three, two, again. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Well done. All right, so the last thing we're gonna do in our warm up, we're gonna come down onto our mats. So come on down. 
come on up to that plank position. And what I want you to do, we're going to start off with push up our, our plank position. I want you to bring your right up, knee up to, ankle, to elbow and back. And then left up and back. Up, keep going. You got 10 sets. Nine. Eight. Seven sets. Come on, we got it. Five. Four. Three. Take a break whenever you need to, but push yourself. Two. Last one. Nicely done. All right, let's end our warm up with push ups. Give me 10 push ups, knees or toes, whatever you want to do. Push ups, we're going to see many of them today. Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Awesome job. All right, guys, let's get to work. So we're going to start today, we're going to start working in a lunge position and I'm going to grab my weights. If you want them, grab them, but you do not have to have them. And what I am grabbing, they're relatively light and always bend at your knees to pick up your weights. If you need your stabilizer, bring it over and keep it nearby. But what we're going to do, I'm going to put my, I'm going to use my left leg first. It does not matter. You use whichever leg you want to use first. And for a squat, I'm going to take my opposite arm up 90 degrees, and as I lunge, I'm going to give a nice push, okay? So I would like you to give me two sets of eight single count lunges with that press, that chest press, if you wish. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, press it. One, another set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome. Now I want you to bring both arms up. We're going to do another set, two sets of eight hammer curls. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, another set, let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Now I'm gonna lean forward, nose over toes, my knees over my toes. I'm gonna go side on so you can see. Same leg still forward. Take your arms up, take it back. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Four, three, two, one, almost done. Still same leg forward. Come down, hold it down. Two sets of eight. Let's pulse it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, another set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Oh, shake it out. So if you think about it, we did four sets of eight lunges, and then we did pulsing lunges. For whatever reason, it seems like when you add that strength component, because you're challenging both areas, it doesn't seem as bad. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Opposite leg forward. Opposite arm is up. And as we lunge, single count, press it out. Two sets of eight. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four, three, two, one, another set, come on. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, whoa, two, one, awesome job. Now, hammer curl, two sets of eight. If you wish, you can always use the weights and focus just on the lunge. Eight, seven, six, 
five, four, three, two, one. Another set. Come on, we got it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. All right, tip forward. I'm going to go sideways again. Same leg is still forward. Come down low into that supporting leg. Bring it up. Take it back. So 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Awesome job. Come down. Get low. We're going to pulse it up. Two sets of eight. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Another round. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Put those weights down. Let's get our heart rate up for a moment before we move on to a new sequence of exercises. So, what you're going to do, we're going to do a jumping lunges. If you don't like it, just do a reverse lunge quickly. But we're going to do a pulse in between. I think we've done this before. So pulse, two. I jumped in the middle. We'll jump together and then jump back out. So it's two pulses in, out. Two pulses in, out. Come on. Okay. That's what we're going to do. Now we're going to do that for 30 seconds. Three, zero. You got this. Take a break when you need to though, okay? Ready? Five, four, three, two, let's go. So with double lunge, bring it together, pop it back. Double lunge, bring it together, pop it back. Double lunge, together and back. Come on, get your heart rate up. Reverse lunge if you don't want to jump. Keep it going. Together and back. Together and back. Ten more seconds. We got it. How's that heart rate? Time. Awesome job. All right. Before we go on to our next sequence of exercises, 10 tricep push-ups. Let's do it. Knees, toes, whatever you need to do, you do it. But give me 10. Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one awesome job. All right, let's work from a squat position. So I'm gonna keep a heavier weight nearby. Again, you don't have to have one. You don't need the weight. It can be just your body weight, that's fine. All right. So what we're gonna start with is a deadlift. Even without the weight, you're gonna feel this. But I'll go side on for you to see it first. Feet are just outside my hips, holding that weight. I'm going to come down and up, okay? Bring that weight down and bring it up. So give me 10, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, squeeze, squeeze, feel it. Two, one, now I want you to give me a triple pulse down. Three, two, one, up. Three, two, one, up. Three, two, one, up. This is a sneaky exercise. It sneaks up on you. You don't think it's too bad until the next day. You're like, oh my gosh, my hamstrings are really tight. I feel it. Three, two, give me three more sets. Three, two. One, up, three, two, one, up, one more, three, two, one, up. All right, thank you for it. All right, so, sorry, it's a little heckling from the crowd. Um, so what we're gonna do the next position is we're gonna come to a standard squat position, feet just outside the hips. And we're going to take that weight, if you have it, to your collarbone. If not, just keep your hands up. You're going to give me eight, um, eight singles. Let's go. Eight, 
seven, six, five, four, three, two, and I want you to add a press, press for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, now add a releve, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, give me eight singles all over again, eight, come on, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, now add that press for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, now have that releve if you wish, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Whoo! Adding that weight got my heart rate up. How are you feeling? Now I'm going to switch. I'm going to grab my ball. If you have it, grab it. If not, you're fine. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to take the ball. I'm going to stick it in between my knees and my hips, creating some something for my legs to squeeze, creating that tension already. So my quads are engaged already. So now we're going to do single count squats, feet just under my hips. I want two sets of eight. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Another set. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. I want you to come down. Stay there, and I want you to come half up for eight, seven. Keeping tension, even if you don't have anything, your legs are working. Four, three, two, one. I want you to pulse it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. One more set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Now give me ten little jumps. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Come up for a moment. Hit where it hurts, I always say, because now we're going to start working. So I'm going to keep the ball in between my legs. And if you don't have it, don't worry. You're going to squat down nice and low. And I'm going to take my right leg and I'm going to focus on just moving my right leg in. Just my right leg, and then we'll work both. So it's going to challenge your brain and your leg. Let's go. Squeeze it for eight. And I'm also raising my heel up to a releve. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Pulse it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Put it down. Both knees going. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Pulse it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two left side releve, bring it in. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, pulse it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Last time, come down, both knees. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, pulse it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh. How did that feel? Stretch it out. Oh my. That pain, that's change. Time under pressure really develops those muscles. So shake it out. Next, what we're going to do, you can use a ball or you could use a weight, a light weight. I'll show you. Just to switch our positions, I'm going to take my hand weight. We're going to work our core in the standing position as well as everything from our neck down. So we're going to do that. Uh, we come down low and we're going to bring it up. Transferring that weight and that power. Come down low, knee over toe, and up. Nice. Come down low and up. Give me 10. 
nine, eight. This can be done without weight. Seven, six. Take a reverse wood chop. Five, four. How you doing? Three, two, one. Nicely done. Come down, sit here, and pulse it back for ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Shake it for a moment. Everything the other side, starting with 12 of those reverse um, wood chops into that pulse. Let's go. Now, if I'm going to not lose weight, just use your arms. Down and up. Keep going. That's nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Really reach, transfer that power. Three, two, one. Sit back and pulse it. Ten, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Nicely done. All right, before we continue on to the next sequence of exercises, we're gonna get our heart rate up and we gotta do push-ups. So for this exercise, to get our heart rate up, we're gonna do either you have an option of a lateral jump or a skater, I'll show you both. So a lateral jump would just be that lateral, pointing your toes, knees turn out. Or if you wanna make it more athletic, make it a skater, okay? Whichever you want, for 30 seconds. Ready? We got it. In three, two, let's go. So you can go for a skater, jump wide, or if you want to make it more ballet-ish, you can jump to a wide, long lateral jump. Whatever you want to do, just keep going. We have 15 more seconds. Get that heart rate up. That's the purpose. Keep it up, keep it up. Five, four, three, two, time. Well done. Let's grab your weight if you have it. If not, don't worry. You won't need it if you don't have it. So let's come to a wide second position. And it's a second position plie. Again, knees are always gonna trail over your toes. You're gonna keep your hip and butt turned under. Abs brace and all you're gonna do is you're gonna come down to and up to. Now to start with, when we go slow, you can grab the weight, but you don't have to. If you're going to grab it, hold it down nice and low, two by two. Down two, up two. And right now, I would almost you not grab your weight, so you could really focus on that range of motion first. All the way down, all the way up. Get that full range to get the full benefit from the exercise. Two, one, give me one more set of eight and we'll pick it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Now I will bend my knees to pick up my weight. So we're going to pick it up. We're going to go single counts and I will add a little bit of weight. If you want to, you can grab yours. Let's go. Eight, seven, six. Set. Come on, let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Come on down. Hold it. Half up for eight. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Two sets of eight. Let's pulse it. Eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, another set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, come up. Oh, shake it, rub it, because we're not done. I want you to come down for a triple pulse and then up. Ready? We throw without the weight. We pick. Let's go. Three, 
two, one, up, three, two, one, up, three, two, one, up, three, two, one, up. Come on, we got it. Three, two, one, up, three, two, one. Last one. Three, two, one, up. Take it down, hold it, pulse it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more. You got it. I'm shaking too. Five, four, three, two, one. How did that feel? Shake it out. Let's give the legs a bit of a break. Standing core once again. I'm going to grab my weight. And you'll feel this even if you don't have weight. Nice wide stance. Just outside your hips. And you're going to bring it down and up. Working our core. Squeezing our obliques. Give me 12. 11. 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. You got it. Focus. Ugh. Hold up. Now give me a triple pulse down. Three, two, one, up. Three, two, one, up. Three, two, one, up. Three, couple more. Let's go, come on. Two more. Last one. Three, two. Now pulse it down for eight. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Transfer that weight to the opposite side. Let's go. 12 singles. Giving the legs a much needed break, right? 11, 10. Make sure you're bracing your abs, squeezing everything nice and tight. Let the weight or your hand, if you don't have a weight, just run down your side. Give me four. Three, two, one. Give me a triple down. Three, two, one, and up. Three, two, one, and up. Keep going. You don't always have to do core on your back. You can really get it just as well standing. Or my favorite, hovers and planks. Give me two more. Up, last one. Two, one. Up, let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Let's put that weight down. Come down and give me your push ups. I want 10. 10 chest push ups. We're up on the chest. Knees, toes, I don't care, but let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, Awesome job. Great job, guys. All right, I want to do one more activity before we hit the bar. Although, can you believe it? We're already like 33 minutes into class. So what we're going to do is we're going to work um, a lunge to a curtsy lunge. And if you want to add weight, you can. I'll show you both options. But let's get to it. So all we're going to do, and we've done this before, so we are going to come back. And again, if you need your stabilizer, get it, go to it, put your arm on it better to have the range of motion than anything else. So what we're going to do is I'm going to lunge and then I'm going to take it back to that curtsy lunge. So we've done this before. So it's just my right leg's going back and 45 degrees. Straight back, 45 degrees. Now your arms, if you wish, when we come back, back, 45 degrees. Back, 45 degrees. Now it's going to be challenging. So if you start with the weight and you need to drop it, Go ahead. We're going to do 10 on the right, 10 on the left, 10 on the right, 10 on the left. Whew. You got it, right? Of course we do. Do what you can. Listen to your body. Let's go. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, one. Awesome job. Switch sides. 
We're gonna put the weight down for one side. Make sure I have safety first, proper range of motion before you add anything else. Let's go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Woohoohoo! Shake that out. Hey guys, we have one side left. Ten and ten, or one round left on each side. We got it. Dig deep. Ready? Right leg back. Let's go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Come on, two. One. Awesome job. Oh my. Last side. We got it. Let's do it. Ready? Take it back. Let's go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Back in 90 or 45. Three. Two. One. Awesome job. Oh, how did that feel? Oh my. Let's quickly go to our stabilizer or go to our bar. And if you have it, grab your ball again. If you don't have it, don't worry. You'll be fine without it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put my ball down. I'm going to come up to a first position, releve. Now, my heels are on the ball. The balls of my feet are on the ground. My core is keeping me up. If you don't have the ball, you can do this in just a first position relevant. Okay? So what we're going to do, we are going to just do a first position full plie. Go as slow as you need to, all the way down and up. Hips and butt are turned under. Feel everything <laughs> fire up right away. Now you can challenge yourself and not use anything. A little tougher, but you can try it. I'm sure you can do it. Keep it up. Ooh, give me five more like this. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Awesome job. Now we're going to come down to a demi plie. So we're going to come down half as far and we're going to pick up the pace a little. You're going to give me two sets of eight. Ready? Let's go. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Another set. Come on. Knees out. Eight. Seven. A little lower. Six. We're almost done. Five. Four. Three. Two. One, now the real work's gonna start. I want you to come down nice and low. Stay low, two sets of eight. We're gonna pulse it, ready? However your arms want to be. Let's go, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, other set, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, pop up one more, please, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh my gosh. Ouch, 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 right? All right. Last exercise standing before we do some work on the ground. If you have that ball, grab it. If not, don't worry about it. So I'm going to take the ball and I'm going to squeeze it between my calf and my hamstring. Or if you don't have it, right here is fine. All right. My knees are going to stay even with each other. I'm going to stay up nice and straight, but I don't want to hyperextend my back. And just take it up two, back two. Flexing your foot and back. Our focus is our glutes, hamstring, and our core. Back and forth. Give me eight, seven, six, five, four, 
three, two, one. Give me another set. Come on. Eight, seven, six. You can even come down if you wish. Five, four, three, two, one. Now pulse it. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Another set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. One more set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. job. Everything other side. Again, if you have the ball, put it between your hamstring and your calf. Squeeze it. Flex your foot. 90 degrees. Let's go. Two sets of eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Another set. Eight. Seven. Six. How you feeling? Five. Four. Three. Two. One. All right. Let's pulse it. Three sets of eight. We got it. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Another round. Eight. Seven. Six, five, four, three, two, last one, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. How did that feel? Ouch, ouch, ouch. All right, let's get our heart rates up. One last time before we do our push ups and before we do some ground work, before we stretch out. What I want you to do right now is just give me a nice, if you want, jump first, second jump, or you can just give me a real quick control second position plie. In and out, I want you jumping for 30 seconds, and three, two, let's go. Jump in and out. Soft toe ball heel landing. In and out, in and out. Keep going. Chest up. Remember, if you don't want to, you can always just do this, a nice control or you could do a squat jump. You could do anything. Just keep moving. Get your heart rate up. Three, two, time. Awesome job, guys. All right, let's hit the mat for push-ups. A little bit more leg work and some core. All right, we've done two sets of uh, chest push-ups. We have to do our second set of tricep push-ups. So right now, give me 10 tricep push-ups. However you need to do it to be successful. Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Awesome job. All right. Right away, let's pop up to that plank position. I say up, 8, 7, 6. Five, four, three, two, stay here or go faster. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Push it back. Nicely done. Come back up. Tabletop. Let's continue to work our glutes and our hamstrings just for another couple minutes. So what we're gonna do, hands are gonna be under my hip, or under my shoulders rather, I'm just gonna bring it up, out, and down. Up, extend, out, and down. Give me 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, and one, I'll just raise it up for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, bring it down, flex it, push it up, 8, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, to the side, one more time, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one, flex it, take it back. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Nicely done. Should have felt that all up here. Switch it around. 
Almost done, guys. Hang with me. We got it. We got it. So take it up. Extend out for 10. Nine. Eight. Look down at your mat. Protect your neck. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. All right, now we're going to take it. Pulse it up. Set of 10. Let's go. 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Flex the foot. Take it back. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Point it. Take it up. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it. Flex it. Ten, nine, eight, seven. We got it. Five, four. Three, two, one. Awesome job. Push it back. Nicely done. All right. If you have a weight, you can grab it. If not, don't worry about it. I'm going to take my weight. I'm going to sit back. Oh my gosh. Is anybody else's like right here is on fire? All right. So I'm going to lean back. You can keep your toes down or you can keep them up. It's going to be a nice Russian twist. Slow and controlled. We're not going for speed right now. Side to side. Hopefully you found today's exercises challenging. I did. <laughs> Keep going. Eight. Seven. Five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Let's roll over. And if you have that ball or anything, I'm going to grab it and I'm going to stick it at the base of my back. If you don't, don't worry. You still can do this. But this is just a fun way to challenge your core. And if you have a weight with without the ball, feet or knee are, are flat. Heels are near my butt. I'm just going to come down about 45 degrees and up. And up. Oh, everything is shaking already. That ball just adds such a Eight. You want to make it harder, lift your heels. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Hey, how about one more set? We got it. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. Now I'm going to take the ball. I'm going to roll it up in between my shoulder blades. Again, if you don't have it, you can still do this. All right. Focus is going from the upper to the lower abdominals. Again, feel through your butt. You can raise them if you wish. Let's go. Seven, six. Five, four, three, two, one. Another set. Come on, come on. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Eight, seven, six, five. Come on, come on. Four, reach. Three, two, one. Awesome job. All right. Give me one minute. We're out of here. One minute. Give me one minute. One minute hover. I'm going to stretch this out and you'll be done. You can do anything for a minute, including a hover. So knees or toes, I don't care. Let's do it. Come on down. One minute starts in three, two, let's go. Up, up. So again, think about if you're on your knees, your knees are just outside your hips. Your hips are level with your back. You're one flat, straight line. Just hold it. Hey, and guess what? You're 20 seconds in already. Keep going. Don't hold your breath. Keep going. Halfway done. Halfway done. Make sure your elbows are in line with your shoulders. If you're feeling shoulder pain, it might be because your elbows are slipping away. Get them back. Come on, guys. I know we're going over. Some days we go over. 
That's okay. Keep going, keep going. You only have 15 more seconds. Keep breathing, don't hold your breath. We got it. And nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, time. Come on down. Push back to a nice big child's pose and just hold, just hold it. I'm gonna turn my music off. I'm not even sure if you can hear it today, but I'm just gonna pause it so we can stretch out. Awesome job. Hold that child's pose. Sit, open your legs a little wider if you need to so you can sit down a little farther and increase that to your back. Nice big one. Come on down. Push up to a cobra. Oh, that feels so good. Stretching everything in your back. Looking up to the sky. Hold it. One up, tabletop. Hands under your shoulders, round that back calf. Chin to chest. Bring it down to the cow. Back up to that, chin to chest. Come back down. Awesome job. Have a seat. Bring your feet together. Having your knees naturally fall to the side. You'll find after a workout like this, you're warmed up. Your flexibility is probably impressive right now. Drop your chin to your chest. Look down. This is great for your lower back and your hip flexors. Nicely done. Let's slowly come up. Come to a double hamstring stretch. Get to that rag doll. Hug your body. Bring it down. Rock side to side. Let it hang. Drop your hands. Push into your mat. Walk your feet in. Slowly roll up one vertebrae at a time. Last stretch today, stretch out our quads, find balance, grab that ankle, gently pull up, knee under hip, hip under shoulder. Awesome, switch sides, find that balance, grab that ankle. Nicely done, give me two big inhales up. Sorry we ran a few minutes over today. I just wanted to stay with you a little longer. <sighs> nice job today. Thank you for always uh, spending time with me. I appreciate it and I appreciate all of our WIDE members. Take care, have a wonderful night and a good week. I'll see you soon, bye.